Welcome my friends, Seven Gray here. I hope you're all having a fantastic day out there in YouTube land and thank you for joining me for yet another YouTube video here on my channel. Today I'm camped just south of Lake Isabella on BLM land and I am boondocking and it wasn't too long ago, maybe three, four weeks ago, that I finally got my solar setup running here in the step van. And because now I have solar power, I have a refrigerator on board with power for that and a propane stove, I'm able to do boondocking successfully really well for the first time. Uh, and this is a rather recent thing for me and I am absolutely loving it. So the question is, is boondocking better than urban stealth camping? And I think the answer to that is it depends. It depends on your lifestyle. It depends on what you like. It depends on what you do for your social activities. It depends on if you're working, what kind of work, if you need Wi-Fi, if you need public resources, if you are a person who enjoys nature and the outdoors. It just really depends. And for me personally, I like both. Um, I think there's advantages to both. The thing that I found that I really love about boondocking is just being out in nature. I didn't realize how much I just love it out there. It reminds me of camping when I was younger as a teenager, as a child, and uh, those camping events that I've done in recent years. And it is just absolutely fantastic. And Lake Isabella is the most amazing boondocking that I've done so far. Granted, I haven't done a lot. Let me show you outside how gorgeous this area is. Right by the river, beautiful mountains, absolutely stunning. Joni and I have decided to go on a little walk around the area around our campsite. So I am just loving it here. I think we're going to probably spend over a week here at um, the Lake Isabella area. There's three things that I'm drawn to in nature, just attracted like craving like chocolate. One of those is the sound of a river or a creek. Just that moving water is absolutely phenomenal for me. The second thing is the sound of wind going through aspen trees or pine trees. Just sitting there, um, laying on the ground or in a chair, uh, laying in a tent, listening to the wind just whistle through the trees is just absolutely spectacular for me. And then the third thing is the sound of rain on a tent top, a rooftop, uh, anything like that. Just the sound of rainfall coming down when you're in the outdoors. I'm just so attracted to those uh, sounds and uh, noises in nature. It's just absolutely phenomenal to me and something I crave and find extremely nourishing. And that's all I have for this episode. Thank you for watching. Savor the moment. See you next episode.